To create any discovery form, click Content. Click Forms. Click Add Form. To add a multiple choice question with a single response, click the radio button. Type the question. Click in the first option field. Type the first answer option. Click the add button. Click in the second option field. Type the second answer option. Click add again and continue. If answering this question is a must, check the option required. To add a multiple choice question with more than one choice, click the check boxes button. Click in the untitled undefined field. Type the question. Click in the first options field. Type an answer option. Click the add button. Type another option. Click add. Continue to add answers as required. You can add an optional help text that will appear on hovering the mouse over a help icon. Click in the help text field. Type the text that will appear as help. If answering this question is a must, check the option required. To add a section break, click section break. To ask a question that requires the responder to write out a single line of text, click Single Line of Text. Click the text field. Enter the question. Once done, click Save Form. Enter a name for the form. Click OK. The form is saved. Select the form. You may now add other details and settings if you wish. You can enter a text that will appear at the top of the survey. A default thank you message is already enabled, but this can be changed. This is shown to the responder once she has filled the form and submitted it. The default email ID where the response to the survey is mailed is the registered email ID of the sender of the pitch. However, this can be changed. Enter an alternative email ID where the response to the survey will be mailed. Page breaks appear after every 10 questions by default. You can set this to something else. You can add an error message which will be displayed in case there is a technical problem while submitting the form. You can also change the text of the submit button. Click update settings once all changes are made.